that's the look on my face when I saw that Ideal 808 was doing a mystery box for $100 uh, this year for Black Friday. Now, normally Black Friday deals are relatively good. Relatively. Um, Core usually does relatively good ones. Um, we've, of course, given out free booster packs in the past. Um, to top things off, the mystery box on Ideal 808. Um, there's not really much else going on in terms of online sales, to be honest with you. Um, those look like they're going to be the major ones, I guess, quote-unquote, for this Black Friday. Uh, if you guys don't know what the mystery box is, 100 bucks with uh, $12.95 basic shipping in America. Um, you're going to be getting box, starter deck, some other stuff, and the potential to get something worth money. So... Basically, you're gonna get a hundred dollars and stuff at MSRB, which is like 50 bucks. Um, top things off, you might have the potential to get something worth something. Now, I'm pretty sure the odds of you getting anything um, realistically not too high. I, I don't know how many people are gonna actually partake in the mystery box. To be honest with you, I assume that the number is going to be relatively low. But last year, Black Friday for Ideal was actually really good. Um, the fact that their sales were changing like every hour on the hour was fantastic. I uh, saw some really cool stuff last year. I uh, got some Pokemon double deck boxes uh, from Worlds that year, uh, which I still have, which was really cool. Uh, but top things off, fucking mystery box for Magic, Yu-Gi-Oh! and Card Fight. Why? Why would you do this? Why would you spend $100 on that? Um, Core, like I said though, Core TC, or yeah, Core usually does um, free packs. Um, if you know what you're doing, you usually have to pay the shipping, but you know, ain't nothing wrong with getting a couple of free booster packs for two bucks, scale or not scale. It was still kind of cool the last couple of years when they've done it. But, like I said, um, that's all I really know for Black Friday sales this year. I know No Limit Gaming's doing their stuff at their store. Um, I don't believe anything's going to be online for that. Uh, to be honest, um, but as for storefronts, Troll might do something as well. I believe Troll and Toad sales are pretty mediocre. Um, Troll's usually decently marked up, says the community, um, but usually cool stuff. We'll see what happens. But uh, yeah, that's all I really know um, for Black Friday sales. Um, I guess the point of Black Friday sales is to get rid of backlog inventory, you know, make a couple of people happy. Uh, and the day, the day is soon, yes, yes, my children, soon, soon, we get free stuff. So, yeah, leave a comment down below, tell me if you guys know about any other Black Friday sales coming along. Toys R Us is doing, I think, buy a 110, get 110 for like $5, so two tins for 20 bucks. Yay, Toys R Us is normal price. But yeah, leave a comment down below. Let's give me a Let's see what we got going on for Black Friday. Like I said, I only know really um, Core and uh, Ideal are usually the only two I know that do anything relatively decent online. Uh, storefront, there's usually really good deals. But yeah, leave the comments down below and I'm out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please thumbs up this video to show your support. And please check out Vancole 40 for Cardfight Vanguard. M. Cole Games for miscellaneous trading card games, and No Limit Gaming for a brand new series of Yu-Gi-Oh! videos. Thanks for watching.